Hello, and uh, welcome back to Age of Wonders Planetfall. We're at war with two factions, and we're just going to keep going forward here. And I'm desperately poor. I'm always desperately poor. Okay, I'm going to wait on this. I would really like um, having a hero that starts in a vehicle. It's pretty cool. Xenoplag hero. Oh wait, that means I can get Skitter with a fast-moving air unit. Oh no. Well, that'll be fun. Active camouflage. Mm. Alright, well, we want this hero. Uh, so we'll... I can just click on, click on that at any time. So we will try to get some money this turn, I guess. Incoming communication. Yeah, yeah, I know. You don't like me. I don't know that trading you any of my stuff is going to... make a difference. Yes, I know you have low morale. I feel like this is the least interesting of my upgrades, so I'm going to switch that out for on Terran armor. It gives me one shield. I can't walk through obstacles anymore, but now I reflect 25% damage. I think that's an improvement for this hero. I was thinking about that last time and I forgot to do it. Alright, Unexploited Sector. Ad hoc ruins. Well, it's probably research based on that. Yeah, I'd say. Right, so this is kind of where we left things off, isn't it? Will this base survive? Uh, I should probably run away with these units to keep them. Where could they run to? Like, you guys can get up to there. So if I run to here, here? I guess I'm probably safe on the mountain. Uh, universal camouflage. I was just curious why he was invisible, if it was like urban camouflage or something, but no. Alright, well, I guess we try to take a city. That'll be exciting. You do not. Do you have plus vision? No. Okay, we'll just move forward. Hmm. We could attack this first for the experience. I don't think. I don't think it really benefits us to do that, though. Alright, well, let's just start with the siege. Now, can you guys move in there? Four movement should be able to. Uh, what? Oh, they have another city down here. Okay. Do they just have three cities? Nine. Oh, no, 15. Okay, so they have at least four. Well, not for long. I have way more power than they do. They do get the militia. Uh, let's see, I lost two units, but one of them was a hero. Hmm. Let's actually play out a siege. I don't think I've done one of those in this uh, particular playthrough yet, so we can... At least not as attacker. Uh, oh, they don't even have turrets. 
Yeah, this is not a very well defended city. Yeah, so all these Kirko units now, they're getting that swarm shield benefit. Shield, of course, making them take less damage when they're adjacent to other units with Swarm Shield. Let's see, they're also going to be doing operations, probably. Okay, Assassin, Hero, and two Golems, which I really want to put mods in, but uh, I guess I'm waiting a few turns on that because I want to hire a new Hero as well. I probably want to spread out my units a little bit. Let's see if that makes a difference. If I move forward to here. I should be able to shoot from there. They do give me two units there. Ah, sorry, what I mean is um, if they do uh, any of we like this, they can hit two of my units. Hmm. How do I want to approach this? Uh, oh wait, wrong guy. Can I? There we go. The engulfer. Range 5, range 7 repeated. Yeah. Yeah, that could be a problem. Um, I think we probably just want to move everybody over this way, honestly. The so you are melee. You also have shrouded step. So who do we want to protect? You're out of range. Maybe our forward sniper. This thing maybe would have been a choice too, but yeah, your melee. Ah, that's fine. You are also melee. See if they're gonna charge it at me. Operations if... available. Answer is no, and they also didn't do an operation. Okay. Is anybody in range of a sniper? Yes. Well, I guess they will be attacking me shortly. Hmm. Getting more units to be good, but this is going to spend energy, which means I'm not getting my hero this turn. Also, do I really want to spend a rock proliferation? Like, that's a greed play. And there's no point casting it up front. So we'll just wait for now. I could finish that unit off. Which would deny them a heal. Get 
Feels like some wasted damage, but we'll do it. Enemy destroyed. All right. What else do I want then? You're going to cover. Okay, Essence Harvest. They should definitely attack me after this. You're casting a spell? No, camera is just being weird. Okay. Interesting. Oh no. Are they really being this stupid? This makes me a little bit sad. I know that they think they have the defender's advantage, but they really don't, because I've got snipers and they don't. Well, if I keep doing this, they should attack eventually. Okay, that's what I was expecting. You could be in trouble. Yeah, but that's kind of our biggest target. But they've all got melee units. I mean, I guess they have a few ranged, but they're primarily melee and short range with these militia units. I'm not even going to use your heal, I'm just going to charge forward. Okay, I mean, that's fine with me. Well... This is probably the scariest unit they've got over here. No line of sight anywhere, huh? No. Enemy Might as well. eliminated. Hmm. Yeah, I could use a little more defense on this side. Cover doesn't really help me too much. It helps against a few of their units. A few of the ranged units. I guess we'll... Take a little bit of cover here. Still 95% on either of those. You have an AoE in one hex, so we spread out our units at least a little bit. Heal link unit and self. Probably. Now let's step forward one. Hmm. 
You need a few units here. Yeah, it doesn't matter how much this thing moves, I can still get it shot off. Let's just move here so that they can't... Oh, that's not what I meant to do. Rotate. So they can't do their battle vomit and hit multiple units. Yeah, makes sense. They're going to use that action over and over. Oh. Well, you've used your heal. And that's, I think, their last heal that they have on the field. Graze, that's lucky. That swarm shield works there too, huh? That's unfortunate that I didn't kill this thing. Wait, it's taking poison damage or something? Right, well, this is going to be relatively easy over here. I do have the phase shift, which lets me get out of trouble. This thing is potentially quite dangerous. Stagger the melee, slow it down a little bit. Mm. Impact stagger, we really want to stagger this thing. Come on. Really? hit point. Oh, it took damage because it hit my my hero with the reflective armor. Okay. Like, why? What is going on here? Well, I understand. If you die, it's fine. Because you have resurgence, doesn't actually matter. Uh, we definitely want to step out of caustic smoke. range does this have? Three? Four. Okay, well. That's always a possibility. Well, we just need to kill a few units here. Enemy killed. This is about to get really bad. I hate wasting the shot on something like this. But Enemy destroyed. But it had to be done. Yeah, the blade bomb might actually just die here. Now, I can air leap. Or 
Target move. Oh, I can't because. It was uh, directly on top of somebody else. Now, do I use an operation here? I think we're okay. Catatonic for two turns. That's really bad. Unit has fallen. That's fine. That's predictable. It's gonna suck. What are they doing? Okay, I'm not sure why they decided to move first. They are making questionable decisions, as always. Again, why? That arc retaliation. It's pretty good. Okay, so this is actually the scary part over here. Specifically, because of this unit. Are you still immobilized for another turn? Hard to say. wasn't seeing a rotate off. Oh, rotate's right there. For some reason, I always read this as undo, but undo's up here. Okay, well, their scary unit doesn't get an action. You're catatonic, so you're not doing much this turn. Enemy eliminated. What's this thing do? Unit expels a 3 hex cone of rotting essence. Mm. Good, we didn't graze. Enemy eliminated. So, I'm very tempted to try to cure this guy. Enemy killed. How many turns are you catatonic? Two. Because... I really don't want to lose my hero. I might end up losing my hero. Well, we'll be greedy. Hero lost. Okay, well, there's gonna cast a spell on him anyway, then it doesn't matter what I do. Okay. We were immobilized for one more turn. Essence Link. Could do that and heal. heal on the following turn, of course. Might actually put that on Overwatch. You... you could still shoot from there. Enemy down! Uh, Alright, they heal when they kill things. Interesting. Ok, 
Okay, we're just gonna overwatch here. See what they do. You're just doing nothing for a turn. You're actually gonna hold back, because you're at risk of bad things happening to you if you go forward. Okay. Enemy destroyed. That's why we overwatch. Uh, that's basically a kill. Okay, so let's do our heal first. And... One hit from anything, I'll finish it off. So we still lost our hero, which is annoying, but... The Syndicate rules supreme. I can get the hero back later if I have to. Avoided losing our Hopper Hound. Only awaits its fate. We want Kirko in our empire. Well, race relations with Kirko going down means that I have trouble with my main hero, or my secondary hero, so I guess we absorb. this another it's another sniper right so I decided to split these guys up these guys are uh, harvesting a a thing right now so they're not moving but this squad That it? I was gonna try to clear this, maybe? Mm -hmm. Oh, we'll run these down. Join up. Sector annexed. Oh, right, I wanted to run somebody out this way. Are you... Oh, we'll deal with that later. I don't have... I don't have the, uh, the influence anyway. Production ready. Okay, we've produced a Mirage. We, know, we need energy for a turn, so I'm probably not actually building units. So I guess this is a good time to get more happiness. Production ready. I mean, this city's a lost cause. It might as well generate energy. Production ready. And I guess turrets here because I'm not going to be able to defend this anytime soon. Where was this? Is where I wanted one of these so far. Oh, I guess we just continue exploring. Oh, there's something. Well, I do have wars on two fronts. I'm kind of just ignoring the one front because I want to... They... This sector? Really? Uh, their capital's right here, so if I can just take them out. Oh, they actually have an army here. I should probably pay attention to that. This, oh, that's not their main hero. It's just secondary, who is max level. Um. Hmm. Well, this is a little bit frightening. I'm 
not even going to bother trying to play that out. The city is lost. Well, we've got a new hero to replace the one we lost. Adaptive camouflage for everybody, that's cool. SciTech grenade. Once per battle, AoE, I think. Take that instead. Rapid movements. Learn skitter, making them harder to hit the more they move, and you are already. Well, I say you're flying, but you can be. Fast. Moving, flying. Goodbye, energy. Tactical repair rig. Sure, we'll do that for now. It's not great. Uh, I can't afford one of the low, low strength ones. Um, I guess actually I want that, don't I? Accuracy and flanker. Yeah, I think that's good. We might want to swap this out for Clarity at some point. I think Clarity on this thing would be pretty good as well. Okay, rapid movement. Fire from cover, that's, that's going to do nothing. And you are technically a commander unit. Range specialist is plus one damage. Could do a couple of those. And I guess accuracy and crit. So do I try to defend? Haven't I met you some? Try to defend myself. We can see the um, syndicate opponent already has subjugators. I saw one of those moving around. Should be a problem. Wraith? Maybe. Start getting more units. Dimensional Amplifier Tower, this is for Doomsday, right? Yeah. That's a bit... optimistic at this point. Uh, tear space-time at target non-Void Tech enemy colony, creating a Dimensional Rift for 10 turns. Void Tech units gain Phase Field, and we can also steal income and stuff. I mean, that's cool, but... Not terribly useful this time. We remember Entropy's malice, how it raged in the hearts of people. Their fear dashed our kind to pieces and destroyed our precious legacy. We miss them. We yearn to never forget them. Others must know the cost of fear. They must know our loss. Build a monument in their honor. Alright, this gets me some much needed influence and also a unit? Shattered Ark. Okay, I don't actually know what this thing does, but that looks kind of cool, I guess. 840 production. So, I mean, that's another thing to work on. Okay, I don't care. I know it's my hero. Happiness event in colony. Production boost, boost here. That's nice. I mean, probably just more defense. Because... I'm never getting an army out here. Main invasion. Yeah. I don't like that I lost the town, but obviously not a whole lot I can do about that right now. We'll absorb it in seven turns. 
Uh, we are the same. Ready. We are the same faction as them, so at least they're not going to do anything silly regarding migrating the units out or anything like that. Uh, this would be a good place to be producing units, but uh, I don't have the resources at the moment. Production ready. Energy sector upgrade, yes, please. Alright, so, just in terms of power, they have, what was that, 21 plus 7? So 28? Supposedly 2800. I have less than that. I have quite a bit of militia power here, though, so if I try to run... Problem is, if I try to run, they'd just attack me outside of the city. Yeah, this is an awkward position. Uh, I think they've got me. Like, I really want to be here. I even have turrets here, right? I do. If I make a... It's the other things, like, if you look at their movement compared to mine. Uh, oh no. Okay. They have some slow units. I thought they already had uh, improved movement on research unlocked, but... I guess I kind of have to run this way, unfortunately. Because I really need all of these units... To gather together. If I'm gonna stand a chance here. And if I run into the mountain. Well, if I run into the mountains, they can't actually get to me. And that gets me closer this way. Okay. So hopefully they retake the city, and that gives me time to get down here. Hmm. Could send a unit out here just to deal with that. I don't think... Well, these things move pretty fast. Allying with the Forgotten is pretty nice in that respect. Okay, you guys are running back to the capital. Oh no. Well, I guess you guys are just dead. Let's see, I think we've cleared up what we need to do here. Ends remaining one. Not ideal. My main army is horrendously out of position. Oh. Okay, thank you for that scouting intel. Very useful. No, not really. That was sarcasm. Okay, so we have a lot of trouble for various reasons here. Really. Okay, well, tactical operations don't matter. Oh. They, I thought they attacked this. They attacked this. Hold up. I might actually be able to kill something here. Right, so this is the Mirage Field. A subjugator is pretty nasty. Not a lot of health. It's just a really tanky unit, from what I remember. Impose discipline. All dentured units. Temp good chance. Okay. No, oh, you've actually got mods. Essence siphon, plague pod, targeting. 
Earth retaliation, yeah. They've got they've got some scary stuff here. Could be about to lose my capital. That's exciting. Does they are all ranged. I think Uh, Overwatch isn't going to do a lot for me in this fight. Overwatch on you might actually make a difference, but I think everybody else is kind of... Not gonna matter. Uh, okay. Not sure why they're coming around that way, but the thing they decided to do. Okay, well, I can take a shot at somebody now. Be really nice. I can take out, take out the golem. Yeah, now they're doing Overwatch. If I do that. I mean, they can just shoot at me. That's the thing. No, we'll make them come to me. Staggered my sniper, of course they did. Unit lost. Okay, well, I get this. I can dispel an effect, but the effect that I would dispel. Isn't one I particularly care about. Good riddance. Okay, got the one. Why is it not showing me my odds to hit? Because it's not your main weapon? Okay, we'll just do that, I guess. We got the one golem, which is nice. Everything else now is just a bonus, but everybody's probably dead. Yeah. Everybody's probably just dead. Yeah, you can't die for a turn because of the cerebral control thing I did. So I'm hoping to get a good shot off with the sniper and then... Yeah, cerebral override. Maybe I can kill you? That would be nice. Still 75. 75. I guess we go for you. Good. And... No, that's not going to do it. Well, if I do this... Oh, come on. Unit lost. 
This was an expensive waste. That oh, wasn't that bad. So this is my production sent sector. This is but scarier. Uh, Jack Gilder wants to save me. I accept. Ah, uh, close enough. One person on the planet who doesn't hate me. I will accept non-aggression from him. Our excavation uncovered a pair of functional doors. Even more unsettling, behind those doors was what appeared to be a rowdy frontier bar populated by man-sized penguins. Yeah, penguins are uh, a thing with Triumph Studios. Kingpin Club. Reward. Dominion of Affliction. Research. Tier 2 Psionics. Focus Venom. Oh, okay. Uh, a massive penguin behind a poker table beckoned to us to join the game. He's the betting type of player. As we get comfortable, it pointed to a sign stating, All bets in Cosmite or your lives. Uh, success chance, 50%. Uh, instant, but 50%. I have already won. Phase distort the game. Oh, is this because I'm, I happen to be playing as... Um, not phase tech, what is it? Void tech. Did I have this option? I mean, instant with 100% chance of success. I think this is a pretty obvious choice and no cost. Using void tech, we couldn't lose. There we go. A miniaturized phase distortion device collapsed all probable hands into one containing all aces. The tuxedo wearing avian rose squawked disgustedly what sounded like, Pah, phase walkers, take this prize. So they caught me cheating but still gave me a prize? Other penguins trotted out a large black egg. They all bowed. The floor folded into the ceiling. Darkness devoured us. We passed out, awakening in an empty cavern. We laughed at the impossible hallucination until we saw that large black egg on the ground. Alright. Ethereal hatch... Hatching. Not hatchling. Ethereal hatching. Spawn an ethereal penguin adjacent to the hero once per battle. Okay, that's cool. Gambler. My hero just got another ability. This hero predicts risks and takes their chances. They are 20% harder to hit with range. It's pretty nice. And 300 research, so three turns basically of tech. Achievement unlocked. Me, the kingpin. Oh, okay. I, I guess that's a thing. And more importantly, we have access to our movement. Let's run back to our main base and try to salvage an awful situation. It's the full action. Well, as much as I would love to have the penguin working for me immediately, I think... Yeah, okay, they came back up that way. Wait, what are they doing? They sec... They tore that off and are building here. That's a terrible sector. And they're not very good at the base building side of things, are they? Yeah, they can't get to me. Oh, that's not theirs. It's quest. They can't get to me on this tile. Although they might get a road that'll let them get to me. But I guess we'll risk it. Although, the entire army should be invisible now, right? Turn. Gives rough terrain camouflage to all units in its stack. Oh, this isn't rough terrain. Hmm. Oh. I guess that's just a, uh, um, a thing about the, uh, the Mirage unit. I didn't realize. Well, I guess we'll do that. Um, I want the repair rig. I feel like this loadout is about as good as it's going to get. The repair rig does allow me 
to heal 36 health on a golem in each fight, which is pretty nice. Yeah, I guess I won't use the, the egg right away. Which probably means I'll just equip it on you, so don't forget. Best passing, of course. Best passing, yep. That's a lot of golems. That's a lot of golems, man. They uh, definitely are cheating on the influence. There's no way they should be able to have that many units. But that's the nature of playing against the AI. It's still going to be... here. Wait, do you actually have a desertion chance? I mean, probably not because you're a hero. Fumble chance isn't great. Production ready. Okay, and I never actually built defensive structures in my capital, so I might just lose it. I mean, we'll try to build it. Production ready. I was very greedy at the start of the uh, start of the mission. To be fair. Production ready. Let's get that started. Happiness event in colony. Okay, well, we are running back with all of our troops after all. Most of our troops, I should say. I will grab this next turn, which gets more happiness, which... Uh, which is helpful, I guess. And then the question is... Do we, do we fall back with these units as well to try to... Like, we need to hold the capital. It's our, it's our best city by a significant margin. I don't want to lose this, though, either, is the thing. Like, we basically, we need to crush both of these armies, which is a tall order. It's always uh, a little bit sketchy at the start of one of these missions. This is still... It was like episode 7 or something. Seven hours in, it's still early game. Uh, turn 33. Yeah, I don't know, hard to say. Because I was looking at that saying, it's early game, but then compared to my Age of Wonders 3 experience, I would actually say, like, in Age of Wonders 3, this would definitely be mid to late game, I guess. Well, by turn 33, I guess it's because it's a larger planet with multiple people, I'm, I'm, as opposed to thinking in terms of 1v1. Competitive multiplayer 1v1 is a very different beast. Like this would probably be getting close to endgame at that point. It would, the match would already be decided. Anyway, uh, that's uh, I've never I've never played this game in multiplayer, but um, I'm assuming Planetfall would probably be similar in that regard. Well, things are looking kind of bad. Uh, next episode we might be losing and starting over. Uh, it's exciting. Let's find out next time. I will see you then.